The novel takes place in the autumn before the outbreak of what used to be known as the Great War in Nettleby Park, which was very large in those days, nearly a thousand acres, an eighth of the whole estate, all of it the property of Sir Randolph, a gentleman of conservative leanings who laments the coming of a new age of striking industrial workers, screaming suffragettes, Irish terrorists, scandals on the stock exchange, universal suffrage. It outrages him that the politicians are determined to turn this country into an urban society instead of a rural one, and to take away the power of the landed proprietor. He may seem at first a caricature of the British upper class, but he is simply a man of another time, a paternalistic patrician who believes it his duty to care for the men and women who work on his farm. His instincts are kind and his sense of humor is fully functional, including when it is directed at himself.